Now for today's video, we're going to be doing a beachfront turtle trap. I mean, it is just massive. It's a massive lake. I mean, we're going to be watching it, so I think that that's kind of deep. There's a little turtle. Yeah, 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 Landon, he's there. He's there. He's there. What is up everyone and welcome back to the channel guys. Now for today's video I'm actually about to head out to my boy Landon's house and at Landon's house we're going to be doing a beachfront turtle trap. And Now Landon lives on a massive lake and he has a beach leading to the lake. So I had an idea because at nighttime there's thousands of turtles there. Literally just tons of turtles. So we're going to go set a trap there and see if we can catch some turtles. Now before I head out I need to get a couple supplies for the trap which is the shovel. We're going to need a shovel because we're literally going to have to like dig a hole. So this shovel's coming with us. We're going to need some turtle pellets as well. So let's grab it right here. And the shovel's about to fall. And this is what we've got right here. We have got some aquatic turtle pellets. So this is coming with us because we're going to need to bait these turtles in. we got our turtle food. That's loaded in. Now we got to get our shovel back here. There we go. The shovel is in and I will see all of you guys over at Landon. Guys, I just got here to Landon's house. We've got our turtle food. We've got our shovel there in the back. And oh my gosh, guys, you're going to want to see this right now. Look at this right now. Look at this little puppy. Landon has puppies right now. And look at this little guy. He is so cute. Landon, this, these guys are adorable. This is Scrunch. Scrunch. This is one of the eight puppies that oh my gosh, you're so cute. Maui had. Give me little kisses. Yeah, Landon just had some puppies and then like the mom and dad. I didn't have puppies. Well. So yeah, my dog had puppies and they're actually going to their homes in two days from now. Hey guys, if you want to see puppies, we'll see them later. But for now, we've got to get started on this turtle trap, bro, while the turtles are out. And we are back here in Landon's backyard. And sorry guys about the wind. It's extremely windy today. Super windy. Like, really windy. I mean, guys, I'm not sure how that audio is going to come out, but like, yeah, it's just really, really windy. So this is his lake right here. I mean, it is just massive. It's a massive lake. And you see he's got this beautiful beach right here, and the turtles actually love to come up. They like to sun on the beach. But right now, we're going to try to lure some in. Yeah, so usually, like, my mom or me will come out here, and we have all these different types of turtles in here. Red eared sliders, red bellies, yellow bellies, Florida cooters, soft shell turtles. It's basically a lot of invasive turtles. So if we do this trap today, you told them about the trap already? I told them about the trap and we're gonna be keeping the turtle. Well, depending on what we catch. Right now I have been seeing a lot of babies here. They love going up under the dock. It's a super yep. protected area where there's yep. um, little bits of grass. You see like peacock bass will right, wait right here, right there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a big peacock bass right there and the thing is, I've seen peacocks like that yeah. size eat baby turtles. Exactly. Which is so crazy. That's like crazy. the only predator over here. Yep, little turtles will swim away. They'll veer off from the protected areas and those big bass are waiting just gone. So we don't want that to happen. We want the baby turtles to live. So we're going to chum them up right now. We brought some turtle pellets. Yep. We could just throw a bunch. Yeah. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a bunch of pellets here. I mean, there's just a ton of turtle pellets. They're really small. But there's no turtles coming in yet. I see one right there. I see one right over there. I don't know oh, if you, you can. You see him right over there? You see him? Guys, I don't know if oh, you can sweet. see it. But it's from a distance. But there's like a little turtle head popping up. Yeah, I don't think it's going to pick up on the camera because of how windy it is and how it's creating this little wake on the water. But he's there. I see him. You see him? Yeah, we got some turtles coming in. I see one way out there. It's really, really hard to tell Let's with see. the glare and the waves. but. They yeah. are coming in. So when, if you're not looking through the camera lens, you can see them. But when you're looking through the camera, yeah, you can't see them. So while we wait for these big turtles to come in, we are actually going to start setting up our turtle trap over on the beach. So basically what we are going to be doing for this turtle trap is we're going to be digging a little pit for these turtles to fall in. So if you guys look right here, you can see that the pellets are literally already coming to the shoreline because the wind is pushing the chum here. So those turtles, oh wow, look at this. There's literally a ton of them. All the pellets are being pushed here. So what that's going to do is the turtles are going to jump up over there. They're going to eat and they're going to follow it all the way in. So what we're going to do with the shovel is we're going to dig a main hole and then we're going to have two different channels leading to the hole. So they're going to walk in the channel and then they're going to fall in the hole. So I want the main hole to be right here in the soft ground. So we're going to start digging it up right now. Got to get this up. We don't need it to be too, too deep either. So even for an adult turtle too, we're going to be watching him from over there from a distance and he's really not going to have a chance to escape. 
So our channel, we're gonna start right here. We're just gonna drag it this way. We're gonna drag this channel out just like this. Look at that. So what we have right here is like a little walkway and you can see that the water is gonna push them up into it. I mean, if I get it just a little bit deeper, the water's gonna flow in more. Look at that right there. So the turtle should be able to come. We're gonna climb in and we're gonna do one more channel right here. Start it. Lana, what do you think? Do you think we're gonna be able to get one? I don't know. So, I've, like I said, I've lived here for like 15 years catching turtles. We used to go out on kayaks, paddle boards, we'd jump on them, we'd you know, find them right here in the shallows. Yeah. But I've never set a trap for them. I've never really thought yeah. about doing that. So, I think this is gonna be super interesting. I mean, with all the baby turtles that I'm seeing out here, I think we're definitely gonna have a great chance of catching one, but you're never too sure. I mean, this could totally just not work at all. We could catch a fish in here or like something else. So far, this is looking just absolutely amazing. You can see that the water, especially here and here, just pushes in and it's creating a little pool. So if the turtle gets in there, this is like a nice little habitat. And even one of the pellets has actually already made its way in. Look at that little pellet right there. So, oh wait, look at that, look at that right there. You see him? There's oh, a that's turtle. a little one. That's a little one, he's right there. Yeah, you see the little one right there? I don't know. We're not gonna be able to see it. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to see it, but guess what? Our food is working. Now that we got our trap, let's actually dig this area out a little bit more. We're gonna get it just a little bit more dug out. Oh, look at that, I found a coin. We found a, we found a, some buried treasure. Some buried treasure right here, pirate <laughs> coin. So now that the main part of the trap is set up, what we have to do now is we have to get some palm fronds. And what we're gonna do with those palm fronds is we're gonna cover the trap up. That's gonna hold the turtle in there a lot longer and the turtle is going to feel a lot safer if it makes its way inside of the trap. We just wanna break them off just like that. So we've got our palm fronds. Now it's time to set up this trap so the turtles can feel a lot more secluded. So we're gonna start now with the live green ones right here. So what I wanna do is I just literally wanna stick them in just like this. And this is gonna give them some shade. They're gonna feel secluded. I mean, look at that. I'm gonna put one right there. And as you see, it's covering this up real nice. And the turtles are still gonna be able to make their way in. Anything bigger than it's like this big is not really gonna be able to fit in. But any turtle that's this big or smaller will be able to make its way right in. So it's a baby turtle trap. Pretty much, we're doing a baby turtle trap because big turtles, I have no place for a big turtle. But if we catch an invasive baby turtle, well guess what? We're gonna keep them. Our trap is done. It is entirely complete and wow. It looks pretty good and the fact that we found our pirate treasure, that's, that's good, good luck. luck. That's, that's, good, that's luck. good luck. So this good luck coin is gonna go right there. That's good luck for us. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna sprinkle some more pellets. We're gonna put some there. We're gonna sprinkle some in here. We're gonna throw more out there. And since the little turtles like to hide under the dock, we're gonna throw some right there and we're gonna get them to come in. So in the meantime, while we wait for these turtles to come out and get inside the trap, hopefully, we're gonna run inside. We're gonna bring the rest of the puppies out because they gotta go to the bathroom and in about, I'd say 15 minutes, we're gonna come back and check on the trap. Oh my go. gosh. It's These buddy time. Guys. Oh my gosh. Look at all the puppies, there's so many of them. Oh my Come on puppies. Gosh. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my gosh, look, this guy's already going for it. Hey, how you doing, bud? You doing good? Oh, you're so cute. You guys are adorable. Come here, come here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> guys, I want all of you to go right now and comment down below. A name for these puppies. Comment down below a squad name for them because, wow, these guys are just adorable. Stop, 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 stop. This one's my favorite. This little guy right here. Oh, yes, shit, little. Look at this one. It's brown. It has all these crazy spots. Guys, come this way. Come on. Guys, comment down below. Which one do you like better? Do you like the, the more golden ones or do you like the darker ones? Comment down below. I want to know. So right now, me and Landon are hoping that the puppies will bring us good luck because who doesn't love baby puppies? And when baby puppies are involved in anything, I think it just makes everything a lot better. Uh, it just makes everything a lot better. Just a lot better. Gosh, aren't you guys just the cutest? Even though you're dropping little bombs, it's just, oh my gosh, guys. Jacob, Jacob, Jacob. Jacob. Yeah, 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 yeah. What? I think there's a baby turtle going into the trap. Wait, wait, you think there's a baby turtle going into yeah, the trap? Yeah, but it's like, it's different. It's like light colored. Really? I don't know. I don't want to scare it away because it looks really, really small. Oh my gosh, yeah, yeah. So I'm looking. I'm looking away from the lens right now, guys. And when you're not looking through the lens, you can see them. Oh my gosh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, oh, wait, wait, okay. wait. I think he's about to go in. We should right. go put these puppies away. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna sneak out right here for a second. No, no, puppies, move this way. Guys, I'm just don't gonna- let out. Don't let them out, don't No, no, we don't wanna let the dogs out. The dogs are gonna run and spook them. On, but guys, take a look right here. Let me get up high, let me get up high right here. 
There's a little turtle. Yeah, 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 Landon, he's there, he's there, he's there. Oh, the puppy, the puppy got out! Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Let's get it. Come here, oh my gosh, come here, come here, come here. Hey, what are you doing? Come on, let's go. Puppy, come on, let's go. All right, we gotta get these guys inside. Oh my gosh, I think the guys, are I got out. a puppy. I caught a puppy. That's what we caught in the trap, a puppy. <laughs> you think the turtle's still there? The puppy turtle. Guys, that was a close one. That puppy almost scared the turtle away. But yeah, 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 I still see him, I still see him. The puppies are away, and now we're gonna go check this trap out. I'm not seeing the turtle anymore, we just looked, so he may be in the trap, maybe he went out, but we're just gonna do one bolt for it. If we don't do one long bolt for it, the turtle could get away, so let's go. All right, we're here, and I'm not seeing don't much. I see anything. All right, let him move this one. Two. Oh my goodness, dude, look, 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 Where, where? Right there, underneath. Oh my gosh, oh my god. Guys, look at that. There's a little turtle in here, no way. Dude, that's insane. I've never seen an albino turtle in the lake. Oh, oh my god, it is albino. I told you it was white. What? No way. And it's actually a, a, a slider. I don't know if it's an albino yellow belly or a red ear. Because we have, there's, you said you have yellow bellies and, oh my, guys. Guys, is this the first time an albino turtle has actually been found in the wild here in Florida, like a slider turtle? Look at his little shell too. His shell's all dirty from like algae or whatever. Here, let's rinse his shell off. Let's rinse it off right here. Dude, what the heck? No way, dude, what? Dude, dude! This is insane. This is insane, guys. Oh my gosh. Look how tiny he is. He's literally like, the size of like a quarter. This thing had to be just one. Dude, literally. Look, you can see that he doesn't have any yolk sac left, so he's only gotta be about two weeks old, max. Two weeks old. But you can see he's got these crazy purples, and look at his little red eyes. That's how you know he's albino. That guy wouldn't have lasted very long out here with those peacock no, grass but dude, that white dude, color. Dude, here's the thing. There could be more in here now. Guys, I want all of you to go right now and comment down below if you've ever seen a wild albino turtle. Dude, this is the craziest thing that's ever happened, I think. Go comment down below a name for this little guy. This was just absolutely insane. And that, my friends, I guess we're going to end today's video off here because I'm just shocked. That is going to end today's video. I hope all of you guys did enjoy watching. If you guys have not already, please go give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below a name for this because this was... I'm speechless. And now I'm sure I'm going to get a million comments saying, so fake, this is fake. Guys, this is literally not fake at all. This stuff really happens here. This is absolutely crazy. My buddy actually caught an albino... Chinese soft shell turtle that someone had released. This one definitely wasn't released. This was definitely a wild hatched one because of how tiny he is. So, so cool. And guys, if you are not subscribed already and it's your first time on the channel, it is the first link down below.